Hello, today I'm going to talk about moving and how it mentally messes you up. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Um, so I'm going to talk about my personal experience as always. Um, first of all, I was born in Central America, El Salvador. Um, I lived there for three years until I was three years and I moved a lot. I am 20, currently I'm 20 years old and I have moved around 25 times like different houses and all that um different cities and <clears throat> the thing now I, I am currently experiencing um a lot of mental issues like depression anxiety and things like that um dissociation which is one of the things that i'm going to talk about um <clears throat> so Moving a lot messes you up for the reasons that you are not yourself or you become too many people at the same time. And you can develop, as I I have heard from other people as well, that have had similar experiences, that they have developed a, a sort of personality disorder because you are forced to change every single time you move. And it's really hard because you have to start all over again. It's like being born again and you have to you have to make new friends, meet new people, start and, you know, sometimes learn a, a new language, which basically gives you another, another personality. So, <clears throat> some people say that it messes them up because they feel... A sense of derealization that the things that they are experiencing are not real and that's one of the things that I experience nowadays sometimes I feel like I had my life has changed way too much throughout my 20 years of existence and I, I don't feel like it is real anymore you know and you, you, some people might say that I'm dramatic I'm just being dramatic but that's how it feels it feels like it's just not real because it feels like a dream like you have had so many dreams and now you don't know who you are you don't know you have changed way too many times that's what happens and I, I don't really know how to explain it but it's just really hard and now I what I experience is when I dissociate, when I dissociate, uh, I don't know how to say that word, <laughs> but uh, when I dissociate, I see memories of the so many times I have moved, and I just dissociate. <laughs> you know, I just, my mind just goes out, and I go to one of those places, and then come back, and that's how it happens, and so, so w w one of the other thing is that you can become really unhappy because you lose all your friends, you lose everything you knew, uh, you know, you, that sense of home. When, when, like, for example, when you go to work, when you, when you go to school or, or go to another place for, for too long, you miss your home. You miss your home. So it's like your heart and your spirit is split in so many parts. And you are all over the place. And, and, and you just can't feel anymore. I, 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 actually, that's how I would describe it. It's like you cannot feel and that sense of home is gone. And that leads to people being so unhappy. And now... It's like I don't want to be at the same place for too long. I have been I have been at the same house for over like 3 years and I feel like this urge, this urge of moving away, this urge like I want to run and just never come back. And it's just really weird. It's really weird. And it's been adding to all my other mental issues and my depression and my how I feel so sad sometimes and that I, I feel stuck. I feel stuck. 
like I just want to scream and I just want to run. I want to run or and never come back. So <laughs> I, I don't really know. I I didn't really plan what I was going to say. I just want to express how how it feels to me. So I don't know. Just tell me about your personal experience. I guess. Tell me a little bit about your personal experience and tell me how it, it's been t for you to move so much or um, a couple of times. Even if you haven't moved like so much, so many times as I have, um, it's still a major change in your life. So it, it, it's still going to have some kind of impact, you know, so... That's it. <laughs> I'm pro I probably have a lot more to say, but I just can't not come up with it right now. But anyway, thank you for watching. If you are watching, if anybody's watching, and I hope you are doing great. I hope things get better if they are not. If it, if they are not. So, anyway. Bye bye. <laughs>